Hey everybody, it's Kim, and it is Monday. I don't know when I'll get this posted because I still don't have internet, so good lord. I can sometimes see your comments, but I can't respond, so I apologize. I haven't been active on that piece of it because I can't. <laughs> and I really can't when I'm at work. They don't like that. Okay, so what a weird weekend. And then this morning we had two hours late start. So that meant that I didn't start until the kids didn't arrive till 11.35. Then they go right, the little guys go right to lunch, and it just was weird. Um, one, the high school is still out. There's still too many trees down. I, I don't know. It was a weird, oh, and I want to tell you, thank you, everybody. Yes, my trailer is fine. My daughter-in-law drove by mine and theirs and said everything was good. So thank you. Everybody was so sweet. Okay, but anyway, so, uh, yeah, I'll tell stories as I go. Went to Walmart the other day, and I found this. They had a bunch of different ones. I got this one, the little chef. It reminds me of the new um, My Creative Time with a chef hat. thought that was sweet, so I got that. And I found these napkins. I thought those would be fun to decoupage, and they're my colors to serve with, so I got those. And I found, I love plastic with flannel back um, tablecloths and it's round it's teal and it's got you see there little gingerbread village thought that was adorable so that will be going kind of teal almost more of a minty green but anyway it'll go mint green teal you know I'm not really the holidays are pretty low-key this year so that's fine um, and with my energy level with school I don't know every year it's just a little less so I'm like a kind of small tree and just kind of keep it low key so I don't have so much putting out and you know. And then next year when I'm retired, baby, it's going to be all on. So Emma and I ended up spending the morning together because she had late start and I thought it was the same time as my school. So I got her there 15, I was sitting out in front of the school going, honey, this is really weird. There's nobody else here. I know at my school, the parents are lined up for miles. Yeah, that's because we were late. So I bring her in and I go, yeah, so I think I pulled a bad grandma thing and I'm uh, giving her ear late. She goes, yeah, school started 15 minutes ago. I go, sorry. Anyway, I even know oh, I work in the day. She didn't seem to be, in, she could have cared less. She's just like, she needs to go that way. I go, okay, fine. I'll just go to my car. <laughs> Emma, I miss snack time. I go, snack time? You and I just had a donut before school and your apple. You did not need a snack. And then 20 minutes later, you went to lunch. So anyway, she's so funny. Grandma, you made me miss snack time. I'm like, sorry. I'm always picking her up late or I'm taking her somewhere late. It's like Lucille Ball is your grandma. Okay. Anyway, I said to her, would you like to go to Dollar Tree? We have no internet, no TV, no... And then I got, I had to throw stuff away from my freezer, so I needed to get my ice cream back, you know. So she said, sure, I'll go to Dollar Tree, of course. And then we went to Safeway. So, anywho, while we were there, I put glitter. So I put my glitter station up in drawers where she can't reach it anymore, because she was getting to be kind of a pain with that stuff. But look at that. Look at that. Pretty cool. Little shaker card thing. I can say that now that I do them. Um essentially ageless but be pure hydrating serum concealer you know i'm getting older i'm starting to look for this kind of stuff i got a whole set of laura geller i love her stuff so anyway but you know try that out for a dollar 25 i told emma you need to pick out snacks what grandma says you know i never did this when i had my boys they'd be like what she had to pick out snacks yeah so I said, so do you have snacks when you come to grandma's and you want to know what's, if you can have a treat, I need new treats. So she was happy to help me with that. So we got Hershey's little candy bars. And I was surprised. She says she likes these Whoppers. I didn't even think these kids, the malted milk balls. So remember that. We both love these. Harbo, Harbo, or however you say it, Gold Bears Sour. I'm running on empty here. It was just a short day, but... This whole time change thing really messing with me. Because right now it really should be a quarter to nine. And I'm in bed by now. Anyway, Kit Kat bars. So she goes, oh, I love those. I go, well, there you go. So now we have snacks at Grandma's. 
I went another time without her, but I'll just, I thought this was interesting. So they're just little strips. And then of course they got the bees, the sky and the honeycomb. And, uh, okay, that's kind of cool. Why not? 22 inch by 36 inch, 100% cotton. So, you know, put that in my bee collection bin. It's getting pretty full. Emma decided, I mean, she was throwing all kinds of stuff in the, we needed these. So I'll probably have her this weekend just for the day because I'm having friends come craft on Sunday. So I don't want to be sleepy. I got Tori a good sized, I'm not going to say what it is in case she watches, but gift. So this is a gift sack. And what I like about it is it's not one of those plastic ones. So I'm hoping it's big enough to fit her gift. But sometimes Tori watches. If you're watching, hi, Tori. Um, I don't want to say what it is. So then Emma decided we needed feathers. I don't need feathers, but I have a box of her stuff and she wanted to make a bird. So we found an owl. So somehow we're going to combine these two. She's fascinated by this egg garden. She goes, we need to make dinosaur eggs. So this morning she started making dinosaurs and she wanted them double sided. So she goes, we need to cut them out together, fold the paper over. I'm like, man, she's just... So we did that, and then she wanted to fill them with glitter. I'm like, yeah, no, we're not doing that. So I said, why don't we fold it accordion style in the middle, and then you can have a dimensional. So she did that one. So cute. Oh, my gosh. She did this one. And then we're working on another one. So and this will be her dinosaur eggs. Or I don't know. Her brain gets it, so that's all that matters. I After my experience i got a flashlight this one you could stand up i think yeah you could stand it up and hang it you know probably got more than one good lord yeah i have a little lantern but you know i can always use more than one and then what i do is i have the little um wall ones that stick with um, sticky circles from dollar tree and you push on it and it turns on so i have those in the bathroom upstairs that's no windows and then um, my bedroom on the side of a bookcase near my bed and now I have one on the fridge because you know never know I know I have this one but Emma wanted it and I didn't want to dig out from my stash so we got that for her box this is for her box <laughs> look at she just went up. oh we need this I'm like okay we're gonna need to slow her down sister so hard to say no to your granddaughters, isn't it? I never did this with my boys. Where's that boy? He didn't want to craft. She's right up my alley, man. Then I found, she was like, oh, that's good, Grandma. I found this. I, I know I have one somewhere, but I can't find it. Where you could, you know, you're always dropping, or I am anyway, the dies. This telescope's out. Move it around on your floor. And bada bing, bada boom. This I, it lands on my floor. I never see it again. Got more of these because the one that I was using was almost out. Then they had, I got this, did I show this? Little house. I thought that was well done. Here I say I'm not going to do much for Christmas. We'll see. But yeah. So anyway, so there's that. I thought that was nicely. You really have to look because sometimes they just kind of like throw paint at it and hope it lands in the right place. But this one was done well. So I got, oh, it's got a chip though. Never did find that earring, by the way. It wasn't in the scarf. Somebody said, you know a teacher's tired when she comes home, goes to school with two earrings, comes home with one. I'm like, yeah, that's a good way to say it. And these light up. Uh-oh, I didn't test it first. It does not light up. It doesn't have the... See, I didn't check to see if it had the tab in it. Ding, ding, nab it. Or maybe I have to... Anyway, you got to get one that... Has the tab still in it? Unless this is one you have to add. Hmm, I think this is one I need to add the batteries to. I don't know. Anyway, I got this one. Not that I go around turning all those on anyway, so really doesn't matter. And they have the cutest little figurines this year. So there's these little gnomies. Dressed a little bit different. And these little elves. Cute. The girls love this kind of stuff. Um, you know, dear tree. I think I will do my tiered trays. I just I don't know if I'm going to put up the big tree. That's kind of what I'm, what I'm thinking. Anyway, there's this. 
I think I might just do my candy cane tree over there. My, you know, red and white tree. It's just a three footer and not get out all my ornaments and all the big tree and all of that. So, but who knows? Maybe the bug will hit me. It's not only, it's not even mid November yet. <laughs> I have time to decide. I found some of these little twinkle. They have the best lights for $1.25. So this is, I don't know, we have 10 on there. So this one's does red, and I got one that does green. Very pretty. It's like, okay. Oh, I found this for Vienna, because she's going to be, what, six months old, I think, when she's, when, come, yeah, six months. So it doesn't have anything that can come off of it, so I just, to put in with, I got her pajamas, you know. Baby, what are you going to do? I thought this was cute for school. Uno Go. So it's just an Uno game, but in this nice small size. So kind of cute. Or be a good stocking stuffer. Let's see what age is. Maybe Emma. Easy to pick up. I don't know. Oh, two to four players, but I don't know what age. I think she could play it. I think she'd get the idea of it. I don't know. Anyway, enough about that. Good Lord, I'm telling you, I am really, I really am a morning person, but I thought this was cute. I am only a morning person on December 25th. They have a lot of different mugs, and this is a nice size one. It's not a four-finger handle, though. Sorry, Eric. Anyway, you don't want them too big, either, like Margaret says, then your coffee gets cold. All right, guys, I think that is it. Of course, I, like I said, I always say that and then go, oops, I forgot. Yep, I think that's it. So Emma and I got her to school late because, but we were having fun. Anyway, I swear to God. And I, Brian goes, I told my, told Kristen, his wife, my mom knows when to get her there. She's an elementary teacher. She knows what to do. I'm like, no, I don't. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's the way it is. All right. Anyway, it was a fun day. So there you go. And I could do four hours of kids. It's like, okay, now I get to go home. Yeah. So yeah, everything's fine here. I just don't have internet. So when I don't comment or heart you or anything, it's not me being rude. I'm always tried to do good with that. I may not catch up because, you know, I just might not, but I'll try to read them all. Yeah. So comment. I appreciate it. And I'll go back. I Sometimes I can read them. It just, it just depends. Sometimes I can get it off the internet offline watch a little bit and then it freezes up so ay, 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 ay. all right guys take care and we'll talk soon bye-bye